brand new episode of WWE Supercard, episode 145. In this episode, we've got more team battleground. Uh, I'm going to go straight into that right now. As you can see, we're actually being leaded by quite a bit. No one is online right now on my team, I don't think, apart from me. Uh, and Super JT, okay, so uh, we are the ones with the two lowest decks, so I'm quite happy that we're the only two online. Because um, that way, you know, look, if we go on their team, they're out of the pe yeah, out of their top four, three of them have used all their attacks. Well, two's left on this guy, but they've pretty much used all their attacks. Um, Sam M, this is uh, really good for me, lots of points, because he hasn't energised on a lot of his cards, and he's worth 111 points, so that's what, who we're going to focus on, we're going to go get 4 attacks on this guy done, and I'll bring you guys back later on in this video for some ring domination gameplay on Alistair the Black. Um, we might not be actually getting him in this episode, because I'm actually doing something tonight, um, and probably tomorrow night, and I think we lost that game uh, against Sami Zayn, which isn't a good thing. We did lose, but the good thing is here, we are going to be able to get some wins. And if it calls Diva, we've got that and leveled up Natalia, um, and he hasn't. He's also... Okay, please win this. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Sorry, I have to, have, I have to do that. You just have to do it. Um, I know it's not in the spirit of the game, but uh, let's be honest, who doesn't do it? So, yeah, um, got... I was definitely going to lose that game, which is a bit of a shame. So he must have two leveled up WrestleMania cards, which uh, one of them I must have not discovered. So maybe the wins aren't going to be as easy as I thought on him. So let's see if we can go attack someone else for the time being. I think Papa Shango is a good shout. He has got Titus O'Neil. Uh, yeah, okay, we'll go with Papa Shango, I think. Or we could try to attack this guy. We could try and attack this guy. But if he's attacking a lot, I'm guessing he's got really good cards. So let's try attacking Papa Sh Can't attack him. Never mind. So people are getting online right now, uh, which is interesting. Fitbin is using his attacks. Should we go and try and attack this guy? He, I think, has got good cards. See, Nations used all his attacks. Venom's used all of his attacks. He's used all of his... Well, we've got one attack left. Marcus has only got four attacks left, so their number one guy has still yet to use any of his attacks, which is a, a bit worrying, but it's only me and Super JT for now who have been attacking. Um, can we still can't attack him? Let's see if we can attack this Marcus guy. He's worth 107 points. Um, I think... I haven't played him yet, so let's see what we can do against this guy. And we'll be getting our rewards, obviously 24 hours, so probably not tomorrow's, yeah, maybe tomorrow's video, you'll see the rewards actually. Let's go with that, damn it, I think we lose, yeah, we, do, we definitely lose, he propped him power, we are 1-0 down, um, tag team, let's just go with try that, if it works, it works, it's not, it is, oh, we won that, <laughs> nice, because uh, that card wasn't leveled up, I mean, well, we should be able to win this, and we do, brilliant. We just managed to get that win there. That's good. First win of the video. Uh, that will give us 100 and something points, I think. I don't even remember. I think it's exactly 100 points. Let's get our three picks. Can we get anything good? No, we can't. Stardust. Okay. Um, yeah, 107, I'll take it. Which now puts us up to 636. Still got 11 attacks remaining. Let's get one attack. Still can't attack Sam. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. So let's attack Sam. See what we can do against this guy. Hopefully we can beat him. We did beat him the first time. We just need to get lucky on what it calls. Please call a female match. No, it doesn't. But it does power charisma. We'll go for it. I think we lose. No, yeah, we do. We do, we do. But that's good. That's definitely a win. That is definitely a win. Level 12 Natalia, I think that is. Okay, and now tag team. It's going to have to be that. We proc. We're not compatible. Neither are they. That Sami Zayn isn't leveled up. Can we sneak a win? We can't. We can't. We can't. In, we can't. Never mind. <laughs> Alright, let's load up the game. Oh no, didn't shot that. <laughs> didn't shot it properly. Let's open this back. And uh, yeah, we'll leave, I think we'll leave it there for now then, because I'm not, my attacks aren't going to plan. 
Um, so I'll wait and see what my heat team can do. I've, I've, I've got the second worst or third worst deck, so uh, I'll try and just use my attacks um, where, where I can, if I can even get all my attacks in. I should be able to. Um, but yeah, what we're going to do is we're going to play a game of Ring Domination right now. Um, Alistair Black, we're about three, well, no, not, not three quarters. We're getting towards the halfway mark on him. Card design looks pretty awesome. Let me know what you guys think about the card design, because uh, it does look pretty awesome. So we're going to play one game of Ring Dom, and then we'll leave it there. Power, come on, please call Power. He procs, we proc. I think we just get the win there. We do. Uh, brilliant. I love that picture on Brock Lesnar. I think that's his ultra rare. I could be mistaken, but I do think it is his ultra rare. Let's go with that Roman Reigns there. Uh, let's try and not play all the games. We're going to have to, actually. We are going to have to. And it will be against that Goldberg. So do you guys... Yeah, I'm, this is changing the subject completely. But um, what do you guys think about the um, Brock Lesnar and... Him not defending the title at all. I know I've spoken a bit about it on the second, not my last video, the, the one before that. But uh, if you guys don't know, he is defending it at Great Balls of Fire against who that isn't, uh, we don't know yet. But yeah, I'm I'm a bit disappointed. He is the champion. We we haven't seen him on TV for like a month now. So I don't know. I find that isn't great. And I thought they would have learned by their mistakes since last year. Can we get a shard on Alistair the Black for this video? We can't. That's all right. We'll be back, guys, in a little bit um, with a couple more attacks in um, in our background. Uh, you guys will be able to see the scores up to date, and uh, we'll play some more ring domination. Also, this is my king of the ring. It's going pretty. It's going pretty good now. It wasn't. It wasn't when I went to sleep. So as you can see, I am currently ninth, which is I'm 22 wins, 17 losses, and. Yeah, it's still a really weird King of the Ring. And also, I'd just like to clarify, sorry about the other video. The cor the file did corrupt, like, the last 10 minutes of it. I tried to put in what I could, but the audio was messing up and the video was lagging a lot. So, yeah. But, yeah, thank you guys for watching this part. I'll see you in just a little bit, and yay. Yo, guys, welcome back to episode 145, I believe. Um, before we get on uh, to getting Alistair Black, Alistair Black, um, like to apologize at the beginning of the video, like first 10 seconds and then like 10 seconds after again. It, the video lags, um, I'm not, I hope, I, I'm, I, it does for now. I haven't put it on YouTube yet and I will. If it does, I'm really, really sorry. I think it's using Leap Droid, so I'm going to try going back to Bluestacks for the videos. Uh, but yeah, let's get straight into the video, which is getting this Alistair Black. Um, we've got a couple shards left on him, so we are going to go get that now. Um, other things we want to do in this video, that is, we're going to pro a card. Um, well, we're going to have a quick look before we do any of that, actually, on the battleground. So, we're almost 30,000 points. This is a GG, a pretty much guaranteed GG. The top guy still has 8 attacks, and Sam has 9 attacks. That's, Ed, that's all they've got left. Uh, Sam probably isn't going to win any games. I've looked, most of our bottom guys, including me, um, we've been attacked 15 times, so yeah, he's not going to win any games against the high up people, he can only win two games at the very least, which is Nakamura and the Sami Zayn, every other one of his cards will lose, so uh, that's GG, because you know, even if he does his eight remaining attacks, it won't be good enough, so that is another Wrestlemania, another win, uh, fantastic, fantastic, so it really is a positive. Let's move on to this ring domination then. We do have a bout, we're gonna go and use this. If we have to spend 25 credits on a bout, we will. So, um, yeah, and also money in the bank. So if you guys do watch my streams, you'll see where about I am, uh, where about I am in money in the bank. Now I have said on video that I don't really wanna show you guys for now, because I kinda of wanna keep it, uh, just a surprise, just a, a, little, a little something that I do on the side that I don't show you guys on YouTube. Um, and I will eventually show you, and just to clarify, I am going to definitely cash in on Alexa Bliss, um, if I have the contracts, obviously. I'm saying guaranteed, but it, you know, I definitely want to, and I'm going to try, I'm really going to try my best. I'm going to grind it out, you know, I'm going to choose a couple of days here and there, really, to, to get like 5,000, 6,000, maybe more contracts in one day, just get it over and done with, you know. Um, so I will be able to do it. And that Alexa Bliss obviously really is going to be essential to my deck. Because it's an Alexa Bliss and she's a good card. And even when we get a new tier, which we'll probably be getting a new tier um, soon. You know, I don't, I don't think, you know, 
a lot, quite a lot of people really got finished. Uh, you know, most of their decks in WrestleMania. I'm only a couple WrestleManias off finishing RTG. Um, I'm not saying everyone's got my decks, but a lot of people do, and I can definitely see a new tier happening quite soon, maybe in the next month. So, um, eight picks, six. We're guaranteed a shard here. Um, it'd be very lucky, obviously, if we could get the card in the next two games. We're probably have, going to have to play another two after this. Uh, we get a shard there. Now this card design. Let's talk about this card design a little bit because obviously now we've got pretty much a full uh, view of it. I love it. I actually freaking love it. I think it looks amazing. So, so cool. Probably their best card design in my opinion. It looks really, really cool. And, uh, okay, they have had a lot of cool card designs. I'm not going to argue that. There are a, a whole load in there. Uh, some of them I've never got. Some of them I haven't really ever seen to be honest. But this one, since I've been playing Supercard on a daily basis, is a really, you know, main kind of what, like, one of the, if not the main game I play, um, I haven't seen a card design this cool. So I'm really excited for it. Um, you know, it's not, the it's not a wrestler who I know, you know, the most about, or I've never seen him wrestle, to be honest, it, is, it goes that far, actually. I've never actually seen him wrestle, but I'm not sure what they're going to do. Are they going to go, are they going to keep this card design now? Why are they doing this? Is there something coming up in the future? Um, it's it's interesting, you know, it is. It's interesting, hopefully, you know, what will we... I don't know, will it go back and forth? I don't know, but I'm, I'm really enjoying Supercard for now. Yes, I thought there was going to be a new event or PC was going to come back. I did, but it's not going to mean I'm not going to play anymore. I'm still really enjoying it. Battlegrounds really got me back into it uh, fully. Anyway, uh, four shards left. We might get it here, actually if we get a little bit lucky on the shards uh, it doesn't seem like we are and uh, yeah we're not we're not at all so unless we get every single one of them right here we oh we could still get the card gonna go on that one it is there we go there is Alistair the black really sick card design really really sick card design um, yeah picture looks really cool that's all I could, that I, it is really, really awesome. It's cool and it's refreshing because not only it's a card design I've never seen, it's also a wrestler I've actually never seen. So it is, it is really cool. Um, we are going to go and lock him in. That is what we're going. I should have, I should have went on to WrestleMania cards, but where is he? Is he all the way down here? There he is. Um, so let's look at his base stats compared to base stats on like, I don't know, Finn Balor. Okay, so... Power, wow, toughness, speed, and then charisma. So he's a toughness speed card, obviously yellow down arrow, which is fantastic. Um, yeah, we compared him to like a Finn Balor, but let's quickly, uh, we've got time to, so let's quickly go ahead and compare him to other event cards and see where he ranks on it. Because interestingly enough, all the event cards so far have been e equal. Like if you take all their points, combine them, they're the same card basically. Well, what this the, the what the straw poll tells me. So okay, again, he is he seems to have the exact same points as uh, as all the other cards. He he gets beat in power by both Brock Lesnar and Matt Hardy. He beats everyone in toughness. Or does he? There's Alistair the Black. Yeah, he beats everyone in toughness. Uh, in speed, he beats Brock Lesnar. He also beats. Matt Hardy, uh, he loses to both Shawn Michaels and Jeff Hardy, and in Charisma, he beats Brock Lesnar in Charisma, and he loses to everyone else in Charisma, okay, so, wait, does Alistair Black 3 stand Brock Lesnar? <laughs> um, yeah, Alistair Black 3 stats Brock Lesnar, what? Damn, okay, <laughs> interesting that's not that's a good thing to know um but yeah that's what that's what i'm gonna do what am i where am i gonna um use the procs uh everywhere bar power i think what well, yeah power is his worst charisma is his worst stat sorry no charisma is his worst stat We'll see, we'll see. We're probably going to go, I don't know, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. But anyway, thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you guys have enjoyed it. Sorry for the lag, uh, The you know, it messes up a little bit. But yeah, hopefully it's all good. I'll see you in the next episode, guys. So then take care. Peace out. Oh, never mind. No, we're back. We are back. That, that, that uh, the uh, outro to that video was wrong because I forgot to do something. And uh, I'm going to bring you guys back. First time I've done that, my, my bad. 
but we are gonna quickly pro this bro this bray wire um because yeah <laughs> that, there we go that's just why not do it on camera I uh, forgot to do it let's go lock him in as well there he is good stats uh decentish card it'll make you know of course it'll make my decks which is good happy about it um and uh, and yeah that now is the end of the video guys see ya thank you for watching